Hi and welcome to AMD Test Drive. Uh, really a wonderful machine. Amazing. Uh, this is the parts that we got in here and the results were fascinating. At, at least um, we were able to overclock it up to about uh, 4.6 uh, real stably and it really was a great system. It's got an 8670D uh, card in it and uh, this is the fractal case that, come with, that, that came with the build. I really do recommend this fractal case. It really is a great case for the money. It's like $100. This is the build sheet. The build sheet is great. Um, go ahead and get it just the way it was. Um, that's the fractal design um, uh, power supply there with the white fan. And I love the, uh, uh, this is the back of it. But here comes up the 6800 series. Man, this is awesome. The Radian Ram ran at 1866, no problem. But I love this. Uh, that's on the PSU. It's got, it's, it's, it's just amazing. Uh, this whole build was was really amazing. The case was top quality. Um, Fractal Design really went overboard when they put this case together, and it's really really nice. Uh, this is the build when it got done, um, and uh, it, you know I, I looked at it and I said, okay, it looks great and everything else. Let's plug it in and see what it does. So after I had installed everything, and it took forever to get all of the, the updates, you guys know what it's like, but I was so amazed at the, what this thing could do. The CPU and the GPU worked well, almost like a discrete thing, and, and this motherboard is ready for Crossfire, man. I mean, when you're ready to put in two graphics cards, you got it. I did add a Raptor, had to do it. Sorry guys, um, this Fractal Design uh, really uh, did well with their engineering and their looks. And I wanna thank G-Bands for the wonderful controller that we got um, for that. But this is the system put together right here. I used the NZXT uh, wire extension for the 24 pin and that really makes it look better. And I like the, the, the window on this thing is kind of, uh, discreet too but that's the build on the inside looking up and you know, the g-band uh fan controller uh got all the fans controlled on there and the thing about it is i love about it you can change all of the things right out there you don't have to pull it out and pull the pins and everything else and no matter what people are saying these are very very good controllers we just got a lot of enemies out there anyway this is the build it really was great. Plague crisis like you wouldn't believe, and it automatically put it on high. I do recommend the A10 AMD processor, and I think AMD is back and back like a monster. Happy modding.